back. Good morning. Ooh, looking kind of rough, but I'm still pretty. Hey. So uh, we are back in the shop today. Boy, what a big surprise. Yay. Nothing major, just a wheel seal getting it done and getting the tires put on the trailer. Um, it's about time for some new trailer tires uh, on one of the one, the one I'm hauling right now. But yeah, so we're over here again at exit four in Grand Bay, Alabama. This is becoming our kind of home away from home. You know, we, we spend a lot of time in Robertsdale, but yeah, coming down here right now. Um, this is kind of be, being a little bit more convenient. And Brian, the manager here, he was the manager over there in uh, Robertsdale for the longest time. Now he's over here. Um, so it's kind of worked out where we get to hang out with him still. So yeah, so we're over here in Grand Bay right now getting the wheel seal done and hopefully that's it. <sighs> hopefully, hopefully, hopefully. And um, then we're going to get out of here and head back down to Lakeland. Uh, got to pick up a load tomorrow and then uh, heading back out to Texas. And then we're going to be doing a 34 um, and getting that done. So go out and enjoy yourselves. All right, y'all. Well, we're out of the shop for right this minute. <laughs> Yay. Maybe I can stay out of there for about two weeks. If I get two months out of the shop, I'll be honest with you, I'll be doing great. But anyway, so what we're doing is, uh, I actually gotta get some trailer tires put on on there, on the company trailer, you know, truck mine, trailer's not, so, but they're gonna go ahead and throw some tires on here for me, uh, do a PM service on the trailer, and I should be coming close to a DOT inspection on the trailer, so we're gonna get that done. 
company I run for, they, they're pretty good about keeping up with these trailers and stuff. So they said, uh, go ahead and get it done while you're there. Why well, waste another trip? So, hey, that's what we're going to get done. But anyway, so uh, got that done. Wheel seal, new brakes on that side. Um, as the brakes come off, you'll see in the pictures, it, uh, or you already seen in the pictures, it's cracked and stuff like that. So it's time to go ahead and change them. So we're going to get, we got those done. Um, and uh, hopefully now, we have about two months or so out of the shop. Be great. Oh, I know uh, a little bit here. She'd be, she'd be so excited yes. to stay out of the shop for a little while. Oh, yeah. Uh, you know, that's one of the things about being an owner-operator. Um, you know, stuff's going to break in your trucks, and you're responsible for it versus being a company driver. Sometimes I kind of wish I was, but I wouldn't have Elvira. Uh, and, you know, she's been my dream truck for a while. Like I said in the past, hey, we're going to get things fixed. We're going to, you know, take care of her. Um, things are going to break. It don't matter how good you take care of your truck. Uh, you can do all the preventative maintenance in the world. Something's always going to break. I've, I've been out on the road for a number of years, uh, and I've, I grew up around the industry, uh, uncles and stuff that were truck drivers. And let me tell you something. I've known guys out here for 25, 35 years, and they'll tell you, if you own a truck and you run it, however much throughout that year and put how many miles on you know you figure out i'm averaging about three thousand miles a week on my ride um you can do all the preventive maintenance in the world something eventually is going to break um and you just got to take it and try I mean, you know you got you can't get down and depressed about it that's why i try to stay as cheerful as i can um and i you know because there's no point in crying over it. um stuff's gonna happen so you just gotta stay cheerful about it and uh, deal with it when the issues come up. Yeah, it's frustrating sometimes. There's a lot of days, man, that when stuff does break, I'm sitting there like, dang, on, just you know, need a break, need a break. Um, but hey, when stuff get breaks, you just gotta fix it and go on with the next. Um, wouldn't change it for the world. I wouldn't change on in this truck. Yeah, it's had a lot of issues. Y'all seen some, but not all of them. We've had some major, major issues. Motor rebuilds, everything on this truck. Uh, head gaskets, head, uh, wiring harnesses, rear ends. We, I mean, we've really gone through the ringer on this truck. Um, but I had a goal to reach, me and a little bit. We always said we were gonna make this the truck of our dreams. Um, and if it took five, 10 years, whatever, it was gonna be that ride. Um, we've always had that, you know, this is what we wanted to do and we're going to make it work. So, uh, stick around. Hopefully things are going to improve a little bit. Maybe we'll see out of the shop. Maybe a little bit will be happy about that. Little. You know, and, uh, hopefully y'all get to see some more of us just riding and not being in the shop. Um, and, uh, stay tuned. I'm telling you, there's got a couple months to go, but, um, I think some big changes are coming. Some stuff that uh, we've been discussing for a number of years. Um, it's not going to happen overnight. Um, we've been doing a lot of preparing for our, our next, I guess, move in life. Um, so stay tuned because I think some people are going to be surprised about what's about to come up in the next couple months. Um, so just hopefully y'all stick around and enjoy the videos. And it goes here, throw some comments, hit the like button, hit the share button. Uh, you know, hopefully y'all stick around, y'all share this, and hopefully more people come around for us, and uh, y'all get to see the adventure we're about to take, because it's going to, things going to be different. I think so too. Yeah, it, it's coming, so y'all stay tuned for that. I uh, can't let all the details out about it yet, it's just, uh, it's a major change, major changes. So, uh, y'all stick around, what's that? Life altering. Yeah, life altering changes coming up. Um, so hopefully y'all stick around for it when we get things done. But until next time, peace and let's ride.